Right, so I hope everyone's doing all right. Thought I'd show you one of these very clever traps. What Jim Gracie of Gracie Bonsai makes. Now he's got quite a lot of different traps on his um, Gracie Bonsai web page. <clears throat> and he said that it was right if I um, copied someone, put some on the YouTube channel. So this is one he calls... I think it's the hovering mouse trap. I'll confirm that in a minute because I'll put some pictures on the um, on the video of his one as well. So yeah, the hovering mouse trap. Now, Jim's one is made out of two pieces of PVC pipe. Uh, one that fits inside the other. But I didn't quite have enough to do that. So I've used a block of wood and a PVC pipe. It's really simple. All it is is PVC pipe, either a block of wood or another PVC pipe, one hole drilled in it, and you stick a nut in the hole. But the nut sticks out... So it sits on top, see it there, it sits on top of the bottom one. So the idea is, is once the mouse starts chewing away at this nut, gets to a certain point, look there's not much left, and then it just falls down and traps the mouse inside. Now these traps are quite hard to show going off unless you've actually got a mouse to do it, if you know what I mean. They're not like one where you can just knock a stick. But you can see the idea there. So you've got plenty, plenty of space for the mouse to get under. Now, Jim's is a lot lower than mine. I've just done mine slightly higher. Um, but mouse will still get that if it stood up. You can see what would happen. It would chew that. And it would fall down. Now I reckon you could scale this up or down. Well, you wouldn't want to scale it down, sorry. Scale it up to catch rats. Maybe even scale it up slightly bigger with a heavier box to catch um, squirrels. Or any kind of rodent What would sit there and chew the bait. It might work by pulling it, but animals that will chew the bait, this would work perfect. I don't know if I can hook that out. No, I won't be able to. I'll try it like this, but you can see the idea where once it's chewed and then it'll go down and catch your mouse inside and then your trap would be like that. Right, pretty simple, I quite like that idea, very easy to make. Right, cheers for watching. I'll see you later.